Okay, for this video, so we are going to solve a problem, no? Or uh, one of the steps in making a frequency distribution table using Microsoft Excel, all right? So this is now, for example, you're give, given with this data, no? Uh, scores of 40 students from a statistics quiz. So how are you going to... Uh, or what will be the first step? So the first step is you're going to copy this one. Okay, open another tab. For example, so I'm doing it here. So what you're, the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to arrange this one because if the ask ay, if the gan kay siya, maglibog ka, asa man ang pinaka-lowest, asa man ang next nga value. So it would really take time sa inyo para pagpangitaan ang value. But with the help of Microsoft Excel, what we are going to do is we're just going to copy all of it. At was ang isunod, no? And then you're going to delete that one after copying. Okay? Copy ka diha. Until mahuman mo copy siya tanan. So, masunod lang na ni mo siya diha o butang. Alright? So, until the end, no? Uh, mabutang na to siya or makapi na to siya tanan. So, yeah. So, as easy as that, guys, you'll be able to copy that one. So, control C lang. Sa naglibog dahi, control C. And then, control V. Paste. Okay. Almost there. Okay. So, it would be... And then, yun siya. Alright? So, usually, mga good, the data is given that way. So, after that, we have to check... First, ato po na siyang i-check if sakto ba siyod 40 ba siyod kaya basig natin wala na copy-paste ganiha. So, how are you going, what are you going to do, no? So, this, this is the value of N. Okay? So, may tabuan is equal, equal sign. And then, type the word count. And then, open parenthesis. And then, magsugod ka sa taas. Imuha na siyang i-highlight. Okay? Up to bottom. And then, close parenthesis. And then, Okay, so I did that ha. Equal, type ni mo ang count nga word, open parenthesis, highlight ni mo, gikan sa babaw, padung sa ubos, and then close parenthesis. And then enter. Alright? So you get there 40, so meaning ang value sa imuha or pila sila kabuok is 40 dyan sila kabuok. Alright? Now we're going to get the value of range. So how are we going to do that? First is we must sort this one out sa, okay? At was as yung pangitaon sa, as I've told you, uh, you can do it ascending or descending. So for this topic, we're going to do it in ascending. So the first step is imuha siyang i-highlight tanan. Okay? I-highlight ni mo siya tanan. And then, you look here, diri sa babaw, pangitao ni mo ang data. Alright? You click that data. After clicking that data, you can see here an arrow down. Yan na yan. Uh, A to Z o Z to A. So this one, no, the sort function. So what you're going to do is imuharan siyang i-click ang A to Z, alright? So what you're going, what will happen is that inana, alright? As easy as that, ang libog ganihang a problem na to is na sobra dayon siya ni kanisiyang sa ano sa ato ang a sort, okay? So inana on rasya. So now you have the higher, the lowest value. And then, the highest na value. So, okay. So, mao ni siya gitawag na to LV, or the lowest value. And then, kanin siya it's the HV, or the highest value. So, what is the formula of our range? Range is equals to highest value minus lowest value. So, what you're going to do is equal. This one, i-click lang na ni mo siya, no? Again, nag-type nag kong equal sign, tapos i-click ni na ko siya nga cell, tapos minus. Katong na, ano, i-type rin mo ka na yung dash. Minus sa katong taas. Alright? So, what will happen is, muna na yung nakakuha sa mo. Ang HV, yung mga minusan sa LV. Alright? So, what will happen if you will press, no? After that, press enter. So, when you press enter, you have now your range. So, kay ba na day kakaroon, okay, nga yung range is 62. So, na number of, ah, uh, Tawag niya na, yung data is 40. You know now your lowest value, which is 118, and then HV, which is 180. Alright? So, as fast as that, uh, mas mapaspas ang inyong trabaho, if ever, 
magamit mag Microsoft Excel. Alright? So, other videos will follow with this one. So, for now, kanilang sa siya for the step one of our, of the, of making a frequency distribution table. Alright? So, thank you. Hopefully, uh, this video helped you.